today's game. Top of the fourth here with the Sooners coming to the plate. A.J. Monterez back out to pitch for the Roadrunners. Steele Walker, the center fielder and number six batter in the Sooners lineup will lead off. He's, he's the one who dropped down the bunt that uh, Monterez threw away in the, first, uh, in the second inning that allowed the first two runs that the Sooners scored to cross the plate. Oklahoma is leading this game 3-0. Out hitting Bakersfield four to one so far through three. So Walker, first pitch is outside to Walker. Oh, and, uh, one ball, no strikes. Groat John even with the bag at third. Max Carter deep at first base. Here's the 1-0 pitch outside again, 2-0. Oh. Outfield shortened up a little bit in left field. Again, we got the left-handed hitter Steel Walker here. Right field is backed up, center field backed up, center field phasing a little bit, a couple steps into the right field side. Here's the next pitch. Swung on and grounded sharply down the third first baseline. Ball carries out into right field, which where Sergio Robles, the right fielder, will run it down and throw it back into the infield. Two balls and a strike. Steel Walker bats against A.J. Monarez. Walker, a freshman center fielder. Monterey's into his wind up the 2 1 pitches of curveball and stays outside for a ball 3 and 2, 3 and 1. Here's the next pitch. Swung on and lifted to center field. Seelman drifts back a few steps, makes the catch. One down, fly first to center for Steeler Austin Walker. Austin O'Brien, who struck out his first time up, is now coming to the plate. O'Brien hitting 318 to the start of this game. Seven hits and 22 at bats, seven for 23 now. Takes a strike call on the first pitch, 0-1. Not a lot of speed here. The infield is backed up, not looking for the bunt. Here's the 0-1 delivery. Outside with a fastball, one and one. Straight away, center field defense. Seelman is almost directly behind the bag. Outfield backed up in left and right. 1-1 one, one pitch to O'Brien. That's a good curveball for a called strike two, one and two. O'Brien buckled his left leg a little bit on that. One and two the count. Monarez into his windup. The one two delivery. Swung on and blasted to left field deep. Deaton back. Don't think he's going to get this one. It's gone. Austin O'Brien launches one over the left field fence just in front of the scoreboard. Uh, no question, no doubt about it. That's the third home run of the series for the Sooners. That's O'Brien's first home run of the season. And that gives Oklahoma a four to nothing lead. Designated hitter, number 24. Several Oklahoma Oklahoma fans here are giving a nice hand there for O'Brien. O'Brien really smoked that ball. It was, Deaton went back, but he had no chance. Cody Thomas, a designated hitter, is now stepping into the plate, left-handed batter. Takes the first pitch outside for a ball, 1-0. Oh. Next delivery. That's a curveball for a strike, 1-1. One one. Well, O'Brien got a 
pitch about right down the middle of the plate, belt high, and he did not miss it. Here's the 1-1 one -one delivery. Another curveball for a strike, one and two. That's the fifth hit now for Oklahoma, and they're about hitting Bakersfield five to one and have a four nothing lead here in the fourth. Here's the next pitch, pitch in the dirt. Evens the count of two balls and two strikes. Sooners looking for the four game series sweep, the doubleheader sweep. They won the first doubleheader opener earlier today, 10 to seven. Two and two pitch coming from Monterez. Far outside, not close. Three balls and two strikes. One out here in the top of the fourth inning. Walker flied out to center to lead off the inning, and then O'Brien launched one. Three and two pitch coming. Swung on and one hopper right back to Monterez. Throws to first for the second out. Catcher, Rene Martinez, 41. the Rene Sooners catch catcher, now comes to the plate. He flied to center his first time. Martinez hitting 200 at the start of play, now below, a little bit below that. Four hits and 21 at bats for the season. Two down here in the fourth. Oklahoma has a four nothing lead. Here's the first delivery. Pitch is high for a ball, one and zero. Oh. Martinez on Thursday night was the starting catcher. He went 0 for 4 that night, did score a run after reaching base on a fielder's choice. Next pitch is outside for a ball, 2 and 0. Oh. Monterey's trying to work out of this inning, get his club back into the dugout. Here's the next pitch. That one's right down the middle for a strike, 2 and 1. Four to nothing, Oklahoma here in the fourth. Monarez into his windup. Here's the next pitch. Check swing. Ruled no swing by the first base umpire. Looked like a pretty good pitch anyway, but ruled low, I guess. So we're now three balls and a strike here in the, the number nine hitter, Renee Martinez. Kate Harris, the leadoff man, is on deck. Here's the next pitch. That one catches the corner at the knees. Strike two called, full count now against Rene Her Martinez. Monarez looking in for the sign. He's into his motion. Here's the three two delivery. Outside, a breaking ball just off the plate. Ball four. A walk to Rene Third Martinez. Base. Number three, Cade Harris. That's the second walk that AJ Monarez has issued. Also allowed five hits uh, through three and two thirds innings. Kate Harris now his third look at Monterez. Struck out leading off the game and then he grounded out to first in the second inning. Harris, a freshman playing third base in this game, played second base earlier in the series. Monterez jaw is just a kind of a cursory toss over to first. Not sure Mark Martinez knew that he was uh, aware of him. He'll be going after Harris now. Here's the first pitch. A little high with a fastball, 1-0. and oh. Monterez's next delivery. There's a, looks like a pretty good pitch there. It also ruled a ball, 2-0. and oh. Now Jake Ortega goes out to talk to Monterez who Took a step off toward the back of the mound on the grass. Probably got a little frustrated. That looked like a pretty good pitch. No uh, squawking out of the Bakersfield dugout, however. First game, we saw a little bit of uh, grief coming from Oklahoma on some pitch calls. 2-0 count on Cade Harris, the freshman leadoff batter in the Sooners order. There's two outs here with a runner on first. Here's the next pitch. That's a breaking ball, catches the corner for a strike, two and one. Harris, 324 hitter coming in. 12 hits, 37 at bats, 0 for two thus far. Two and one, Monarez comes to the plate. Swung on a miss, strike two, took something off that pitch. 
Ball showed good movement, breaking away from the left-handed hitter. 2-2 Two -two count now on Harris. Short lead by Martinez at first, being held on by Max Carter. Here's the pitch. Swung on and popped up down the left field line. Don't think anybody's going to be able to get to it. It actually lands in the... Looks like Grochon actually nearly made ran the ball down. It was right there near the Sooners bullpen. Just wasn't able to get to it. So we'll come back to the plate and the count remains three and two. Two and two, excuse me. Two, two count here. Martinez short lead at first. Mark Monterez takes a look at him, but I don't think he's worried he's going anywhere. Here's the pitch. Swung on and grounded sharply off of Max Carter's glove at first base. And then a flip by the second baseman, Metzger, that strikes the base runner. And the runner, Rene Martinez, runs from second to third. So that'll be an error on Metzger for, should have just eaten the ball there. Infield hit for Cade Harris. Bakersfield getting a little loose with the defense here in this game. So that puts runners on first and third with two out. And number two hitter Hunter Haley, the batter. Haley singled in the first, was thrown out stealing, and then popped out to left field in the third. That ball was hit very sharply. Carter was able to get a glove on it, but couldn't uh, come up with it. Base hit was the right call. The ball was hot, too hot to handle. And then Metzger complicated things by trying to do a flip to uh, someone, and there was nobody covering first. And so and as it hit the base runner, the ball rolled up the first base line a little bit. And uh, Martinez, the runner who had reached second base, alertly raced over to third. First and third now, a two out, a run in on the home run, and here's the next pitch. That's a fastball in the inside corner for a strike. Austin O'Brien homered the with one out here in the fourth to give the Sooners a 4 nothing lead. They're looking to add on with runners on first and third here and two out. Monarez in his stretch, looks at third. Here's the pitch. Swung on and grounded in pass mark, diving Carter into right field for a base hit. Coming in to score is O'Brien. Cade Harris races, races over to third. It's now 5 to nothing. In Shortstop, number 22. And Hunter Haley gets his second hit and an RBI single. And Bob Macaluso, the Bakersfield manager, races out to uh, walks out very slowly to the mound. Monarez is allowed seven hits. The Sooners have a five to nothing lead at this point. This is not exactly. He's looking toward the bullpen. This is not what Bakersfield's looking for. They're really are hoping to get some innings out of their starters here because the bullpen's been uh, a little bit inconsistent. And you know the last thing you want to do is run the bullpen out there. So, um, but right now it's 5 nothing already and the Sooners are in danger of really running away with this one. They've already won the first three games of this series. Umpire, home plate umpire goes out there to try to break up the meeting. And again, Macaluso just doing some talking, trying to pep his players up, talking to the catcher Ortega, talking to Monarez, and now he's going to stick with Monarez for the moment. Nobody warming up for the bullpen, but you got to figure that they have several players that can pitch that are on the uh, on defense right now, so that could be the way that Macaluso is looking at it. Right now, Sheldon. Noisy, the batter, and a very dangerous hitter. He had an RBI, or he had a triple and scored in this the last time at bat. First pitch is high for a fastball for a ball, 1-0. and oh. Noisy tripled in the third inning and scored. 5 nothing here in favor of the Sooners. They have runs on first and third. Two runs in already this inning. Here's the next pitch. Breaking ball for a strike, 1-1. One and one. Oklahoma 
coming out to California, beat Fresno State on Tuesday night, and they're looking to try to go 4-0 against Bakersfield this weekend. One and one count on Noisy. Here's the pitch outside with the fastball. Two and one. Roadrunners looking for some consistency on the mound. Becoming more and more crucial. The bottom line, of course, is being consistent once you get to your league play, and that starts next Friday in Seattle. Two and one pitch. Swung on. Line drive, right field. Base hit. One hop to Robles. Coming in to score is Kate Harris. That makes it six to nothing. Hunter Haley stops at second. Sooners here have uh, strung some hits together in this inning. They've got a home run and a walk and three straight singles. They have opened up a six to nothing lead. They have now eight hits in three and two thirds innings against the road runners. Monterez has also walked a pair Cleanup batter, Jack Flansburg. He's the eighth man to bat in the inning. Three runs are in already this inning, and the lead is up to six to nothing for Oklahoma. So Monarez comes to the plate. Swung on and grounded sharply to first. Carter races to his left and picks it up right along the first baseline, tags the base for the out, and the inning is over. But the Sooners add three more runs on a home run by Austin O'Brien, RBI singles by Hunter Haley and Sheldon Noisy, and they have opened up a six to nothing lead over Cal State Bakersfield here as we go to the bottom.